What's good, team exclusive, and welcome back to some more FIFA 21 content. Today, we are back with a brand new episode of The Road to Glory. Um, yeah, I'm not sure today exactly what the title's gonna be, because we've got quite a lot of stuff to go through. Not only some uh, pretty insane pack pulls, which is most likely gonna be the gonna be the title. Um, yeah, I insane. I wanna roll a clip um, of the, the, the pack pull that we got, so four more to go after this one. Fifth ultimate pack. What are we saying? Walk out. Ooh, it's a blue. I'm going to skip it because it could be an 8-4 above. Watch it be Ronaldo. Oh, yo, we got Neymar. Holy shit. We just packed Neymar. Love to see it. No, he's like 8. Oh, my fucking God. We just got Neymar and I skipped it. Nutty. Nutty, nutty stuff. We packed Neymar. Can you believe it? And also, the fa the funny thing about it was, um, not only did we pack Neymar, we also packed like Lewandowski, Carl Walker, you know, some some pretty good stuff like Edison as well. Um, but it, what's annoying about it is that it obviously came out as a UCL, so obviously you know it's like oh, it's a bit dead. But then th that that occasion, it turns out to be to be Neymar, like mental. The amount of times we've got a Brazilian flag and then it be goalkeeper or CDM is nutty. And then this time it would have actually been the left wing. It's just insane. Of course, he did sell for about what like eight hundred and something thousand coins. So crazy crazy good pack pool i think that's got to be up there i actually think that's probably the most expensive pack pool we've had on this account um that's actually been tradable crazy stuff crazy stuff we've got a few packs in store so um you know there's always there's always chance there's always chance last i've got a few um two rare gold players packed to start off this episode and a few spc packs uh and objective packs so you know, there's always a chance. Last time we did a few two rare gold players pack, we um, packed Kulaveski. Um Yeah, pretty good stuff. And we've got a few, we've bought a few new players into the club as well, because obviously, as you can see, we've only got uh, just under 100k left. And uh, yeah, we uh, sold literally everything. The way I've been, I'll open a few packs as well. Um, the way I've been trying to run this, this Road to Glory account is keep it all untradeable. Everything that's tradable, we sell, try and make profit. Did you get a board out of this pack as well? It's pretty decent. Argentina, right wing, Barcelona. Who's sick of that joke? Not me. Um, yeah, I've been trying to keep it all untradeable. So everything that's tradable, we sell. And everything that's not tradable, we either put into SVC packs or we uh, sell on. So, and I could do like the whole no man left behind thing, but I really just can't be bothered. Really just can't be bothered. So I'll get these out of the way first. Get these out of the way. So, it, you know, it'll be good. It'll be good stuff. Um, obviously, there's only um, there's only one what if player that I really would like to get, and that of course would be Udegaard. That's the one I really want, just because he's Arsenal. Not that I think he's actually going to get an upgrade. Who knows? Arsenal might surprise us. He might surprise. He's still like, well, he was like 600k. Six. What the hell is this? Every time he does that to me. Every time, and I'm really confused what it is. Um, yeah, he was like 650,000 coins last night when I was looking at him, obviously because we got Neymar and I thought, oh, you know, maybe, maybe there's a chance. Um, yeah, so maybe people think he is going to get an upgrade. I, I really don't know, to be honest, really don't know. It'd be good if he does, then it'd be 90 rated, it'd be more of a beast. And, uh, yeah, you, you, you love to see it. You love to see it. What are we saying? Come on, EA Sports. What are we saying? Does the board say? Boards are always quite good. Especially as as we're trying to keep it okay. I mean Okay, well that's not really that helpful, is it? Not really that helpful. 283 so is a is a it's a pretty decent pack considering. Considering. Nope. <laughs> yeah, the, the chance of us getting a walkout is probably quite low, but like I said, you know, last time we did about 10 of these, we got Kulaveski in Future Stars. So, you know, I'm just saying. Just saying. Was that an inform? It wasn't. No, it was Daily Blind. Brilliant. Another boards, though. Another board. Boards are always very helpful. Get Dries Mertens. That's actually pretty good. It's actually pretty good. Considering these have been pretty woeful. Two left to go. What are we saying? Yo, walk out. Hey, let's go. We actually got one. I, what am I saying? It's Yuri Berachish. Let's go. I told you. 
We did 10 last time. We got a future stars. This time we got a what if player, Yuri Berichish. He looks so good as well. And he might get an upgrade. He actually might get an upgrade. Let's go, man. Let's go. You love to see it. You love to see that. He's still like 200,000 coins. Yeah, there's a big chance he's going to get an upgrade. Possibly. I know Mbabu's already probably going to get one, which feels bad, man. But uh, yo, let's go. It paid off. It paid It paid off. I'm, I'm buzzing about that. Buzzing. Might have to change up our backline, to be fair, to try and uh, try and fit him in. Maybe get like a Sergio Ramos and stick Yuri Berechish. Oh, that was the one, Yedlin, who moved. Um, yo, let's go. I can't believe we actually got one. That's nutty. Anyway, the... Oh, uh, wow. Okay, I don't even know what to title this video now at this point. It might just be... <sighs> Fuck knows at this point. But anyway, anyway, I've been doing a little bit of bronze pack method as well to try and sell some of these things, see if they actually sell, test them out. I don't, I don't really fully understand bronze pack method because a lot of it is just garbage. So, you know, I, I don't know. Maybe I'm out of the loop. But we bought three, three big players into the club. We bought three huge players into the club. And uh, yeah, I'm not going to waste any time. There's no point delaying it. We also got, we bought up Martin Udegaard. Let's go. Can't wait to try this guy out. Obviously, 680,000 coins. Um mental mental looking card and obviously if he does get an upgrade you can just imagine all those stats plus two um if they do it like that maybe it'd be like 88 88 shooting that kind of stuff it'd be crazy crazy good and obviously look at that like that's his price now obviously when there's no promo pack so i could sell him and make like you know a pretty big profit um but if he gets an upgrade i might sell him then and then get him a bigger upgrade but also the fact i wanted him because he links to harland i mean kind of get that Borussia Dortmund Arsenal link up there, which is so, so sick. Then, of course, the next play, big player we got is uh, Man of the Match, Olivier Giroud. Uh, that would be pretty good to try out in the um, Road to a 1000 series with Henri. Get them both up striker. That would be pretty fun. And then, of course, the next one was Prime, Burkamp. Let's go for 688,000 coins. Again, not much more than that, but he is more than that. So I could, I could make some profit. Big trader. I, I'm telling you that the brain is massive. Brain is massive. Anyway, um, yeah, crazy. Crazy. All the stuff we got, like, yesterday, Neymar, got Lewandowski, Edison. We got really lucky in some packs. Like, our luck has been crazy. And obviously now getting Yeti better cheesh. Um, it's just been through the roof. Our luck has literally been through the roof for pretty decent pack pulls besides icons. We just haven't, uh, haven't pulled any of those, really. So, not that I can complain. Not that I can complain. I think the players we've probably packed are more expensive than icons that you could get um so good stuff but yeah crazy crazy i i can't believe that you you love to see it you love to see it um so this was the team i was using for um what was i using for for the fafana recipe uh objective just trying to get some of the french players obviously we can take those out um i don't i don't know what to do now i really don't know what to do really don't know what to do um where are we so obviously we've got martin udegaard there's that middle bird camp got on loan but now we have the prime 92 bird camp he's always just been somebody i've wanted for the for the team you know linking up to omri again um magic pure pure magic um yeah it'd actually be quite good for our la liga team when we build it so we'll link up to What's his face? Um, Marcus Lorente. And then he'll link up to Suarez. And then Jean-Felix as well. So, yeah. I mean, like, that's pretty much how the team is going to look. That's pretty much what it looks like. Um, that's pretty sensational. It's pretty sensational stuff. Um, I could obviously play Udegaard there. But obviously, Burkham's better. I, I, I'm going to try Burk. I might, you know, swap between them during this episode and uh, give them all a bit of a go. But um, yeah, it's good to have a few tradable players, I think, in the club because now we've got like 3 million coins worth of players. Um, obviously, Henri still sitting at that 2.5 milli mark. Crazy. Crazy. It might be interesting to see actually how much this, how much this one goes for. Just as like a. Not, I'm not going to sell him. I'm never going to sell this card. Um. 
unless I pack him untradeable, I guess. But yeah, um, there is that. So I don't know what to do now. We now have two what if players. I, I still can't believe we managed to get one. That's crazy. Mental good. Mental good. Mental good. Um, yeah, like if we just come, obviously he's 87 rated compared to an 81, but Davies is always a bit OP. You can just, oh, it's just levels above, isn't it? It's just levels. We could do, oh, of course, actually, wait, we could do this. Hold on. Let's get Davies out. Let's get Kepa, oh, Kappa, sorry, in there. Yo, that's pretty decent, to be fair. That's pretty decent. Ain't gonna lie, that's pretty decent. I wonder if, um, if Neuer would give 100 chemistry, uh, 10 chemistry to Boateng. Not that it really matters, but, um, let's just have a look. So, Neuer, it would. So, perfect link. And Neuer would give 100 chemistry, uh, 10 chemistry to Boateng. What are we saying? How much is an inform Neuer going for? Um... Never mind then, I guess. Really no inform noise on the market at all. Oh, there is. Oh, he's 200k though. Okay, let's do it. Why not? And then we'll get uh, a really decent goalkeeper in there as well. And then we'll have Boateng on 10. And uh, yeah, that's how the team's probably going to look. I mean, perfect linking from Yuri Berdicic to Kepa. You love to see it. You love to see it. And even though Kepa's... Oh, I keep calling him Kepa. Ka Kappa isn't the best. You know, his dribbling is actually very good for a CDM. Obviously, going from right back to CDM, his passing is not bad. With a bit of a boost, it's, it's okay. Shooting's not terrible. I mean, it is pretty terrible, actually. So, for an 85 that we got free as an objective player a while ago, he's actually, he's actually still a very good player. You know, thinking about it, actually, as much as I would have loved to pack, you know, a Kante, um, I... Uh, a Gomez would have been good, you know, the, the what if Gomez and obviously the what if Kante. Sancho, I have no need for, no interest for. Uh, I think Yuri Berdicic actually is the best player that we could have packed to upgrade our team. There's actually somebody usable that we can put straight into the starting 11, have them on 10 chemistry, and just play with them and actually have them as like a beast. Um, like everybody else would have either made it on the bench. Kante also would have gone over Pogba, but then like we've got an 88 rated in form that's untradeable, so. It's a bit, it's a bit pointless, but yeah, I can't believe it. Our luck has just been something else. Really has been something else. I think as well at this point, um, I'm going to start saving packs for team of the year. Start saving all those kind of like objective packs. Um, you know, everything that's more than like, I'd say mega pack and up. I'd say, yeah, probably mega pack and upwards. I'll start saving maybe like premium player packs and stuff like that. Um, Probably going to start saving for team of the season, um, which is, you know, crazy to say. But I think it's it's better that we start early, get loads of packs, and then don't have to really have to really spend any money, hopefully, on that uh, that promo as well. So all rivals, packs and stuff, I'll probably start saving for uh, team of the season now. Team of the season. Can you stop bidding and let me have this Neuer, please? Three, two, one... Hey, let's go. We got a cheap Neuer. And there we go. So actually, we have four big players coming into this. Well, no, five, actually. Five big players. We've got Burkamp. We've got Udegaard. We've got Yuri, Yuri Berechish. And then we've got Manuel Neuer. Is that everybody? Yeah, here's everybody. Crazy. Mental. And also, if we wanted to be a little bit crazy, we could still do... Bam. Bam. And bam. If we wanted to go completely mental. But we don't want to do that. Because these players are better. <laughs> but yeah. That's kind of how I'm hoping that. A future second team will, will, will look. Um, I, I still think it's crazy. The amount of players we've got. That we that don't even make the bench. Like. Witzel. Grealish. Rainier. Harland, um, I'm sure there's other people as well that don't make the bench, but yeah, Rooney, mental. Oh, well, anyway, first opponent today has got a Garincha, very nice. It's got Bruno Fernandes, it's got Fafana, De Bruyne, it's got that uh, Indeedy, who's no longer getting, getting an upgrade. 
sucks to suck, doesn't it? Oh, let's go. Omri on his bike already. Oh, I actually didn't expect the goalkeeper rush that quick. That actually uh, threw me off big time. Wow, okay. Oh, excuse me. Why did Bellerin not get that? Eh, never mind. Oof, what a good save by Neuer. Let's go. Ah, oh, come on, man. It's getting absolutely abused there. Good job, boy, thing. Let's go. Henri again. Yep, not that time. I'm sorry, you, you caught me out twice, but third time, no chance. Henri uh, sinks that straight into the back of the net. Let's go. It's another big save by Neuer. You love to see it. Yo, let's go. Henri. Bang. Second goal, Henri. He's too good, man. He is too good. This guy is actually dirt. Yo, look at Maradona go on his bike. Let's go. See Henri making that run inside. Yo, that's a high leg, man. That, that's a, that is genuinely a foul. That would be a penalty in most modern games because, because people are soft. I don't know. <laughs> Let's go Kaka from there. Yo, can Maradona though? Oh, he couldn't quite jump high enough because he's tiny. What a... I, I kind of panicked there, to be fair, but uh, that was one hell of a clearance. One hell of a clearance. Look at Kaka in there. Oh my god. And he wins the header as well. Makes it 3-0. Holy... Oh, he almost got there as well. Wait. Pogba. Maradona. Okay. We're going to test out uh, somebody's free kicks. I think it... Has it got to be Pogba? It's got to be Pogba, isn't it? Right. We did this yesterday. Against the silver team. Can we do it today? Yellow timed it. Ooh. Still wasn't bad, though. Still was not bad. That was right in the corner. Why he took uh, took that extra touch, I don't know. But he got a goal from it, so fair enough, I guess. Fair enough. Uh, it's probably deserved in some respect. Uh, you actually got to be kidding me. Uh, it's just mental, man. There is no way. There is no way that's a penalty. I'm sorry. <laughs> it was a good time challenge. He just hit the ball and actually got it, but... Wow. Ah, fuck. It's frustrating, but it is what it is. Oh. Yeah. It's, it's, it's a good goal as well. I could see it happening. I just couldn't select the player quick enough, man. I don't know what I can do. I really don't know how I haven't been haven't won this game as well. I've had so many chances. You look at that ball as well. He's actually got that. Nah. Well, nah. I'm sorry. That ball from the halfway line to get to Omri and then he got onto it as well. Not only that, and then he also scored it past Allison, who's been saving fucking everything. Watch this. Bang. Go on, Omri. Oh. He almost. He wanted to win it. I see Burkamp. Omri. Burkamp. Hacker, bang, game over. There we go. We sh it shouldn't even been that close anyway, to be fair, because I've been literally all over this guy. And uh, the fact that he, he's got three goals is kind of embarrassing, you know. But I, I really don't think it's it's anything that I've done, to be fair. It's just this game has been weird. Like, that penalty call was just completely out of line. Noy has been excellent as well. Watch this. Bang. Burkamp's actually going to go on to it. I don't know why Allison is there so quick, but fair enough.
we're just we're just playing with our food at this point. Just playing with our food. That was uh, our sensational play. Sensational play. Done. Game over. Job done. See you later. And there we are. GG. 6-3. Mental. Mental. I knew once it got to 3-3, I was like, no, I have to kind of like turn it up because there, there's no way I could lose to that guy. There's absolutely no way. Thierry Henry, though. 10 attempts, 3 goals. Crazy. Oh, shit. What a team. It's got Neymar. Pele, mid Pele as well, has got Tony Cruz, Varan, Kunde. It's going to be an absolute nightmare to break down. I mean, I, I really, I respect the, the use of these weird, odd players. Go on. Oh, is he onside? Doesn't matter. Kunde has got there, but he's given away pens. So, like, that shouldn't be a pen. It, like, it's just contact, man. Physical sport and all that. Good save as well. Good save. It was a good finish. The thing is, I knew he was going to turn that way. And literally, I just couldn't get Boateng to turn quick enough. Go on, Henri. Let's go. Bang. Goal. There you go. Not even your fucking Kunde or Varane could, could stop this beat. Kunde is just too much, man. I literally can't deal with it. Henri. <laughs> Henri. <laughs> he couldn't handle it. He knew. The thing is, I don't actually think he was going to score that, in all fairness. Because um, he was, like, running onto it late. I was trying to finesse it, and I don't think he would have scored that. So, fair play. Fair play. you love to see it. Next team, Scott. It's got a nice team as well, to be fair. Nice. It's a standard gold Premier League team, but it's got some dangerous players. Sterling, Salah. It's got uh, Prime, Rude Van Nistelrooy. It's got Vardy and De Bruyne as well up top. Very good stuff. Good start. Oh, you can't give it away to Henri. Come on, Matt. I now have to take long-range free kicks. This is my specialty. Let's go. Red card. I'm Eric Laporte. See ya, you're Eric Laporte. <laughs> it's a good effort. I don't think I put enough power on it, but uh, it's a good effort, to be fair. Oh. This is, uh, this is an interesting development. Hmm. I... Where did my defence go? <laughs> Where did my defence go? What was that? He was rapid as well. Van Nistelrooy. Yo, come on, man. Why have you been so aggressive? What What did I do to you? Great job, Pogba. Thank you very much for that. Henri? What? What? Good lord. These these bounces in this game, there's some bounces in this game that are just mental, man. I mean, pretty much every bounce in this game is absolutely mental, but... I just couldn't... I couldn't get my players to make the run. Oh, uh, come on. Henri still got there. Not anymore. Come on, Udegaard. He got it. What? Another penalty. Go on, send him off. Oh. Wow, okay. He has uh, literally no centre-backs anymore. No centre-backs. We have to score this as well. Really. There we go. Big goal. Big goal. He's got nine men. Who... Who's he, who's he going to bring on now? Like, who did he bring on to start with? He brought on Kante at centre-back. And now he's, he's got literally... Wow, okay. Henri! There we go. I didn't want to say too anything too soon because Alisson has been a beast against me. Um, so you never know, but there we go. Henri makes it 2-1. Uh, I, I mean, 
the chances of me losing this game are still very high because I'm a massive crumble job. So, you look at Omri come back and defend, man. This is things you do love to see. Okay, well, he, he couldn't slow down quick enough, apparently. Good job, Boateng. Let's go. Maradona's away. Doesn't matter. Henri! Bang! Bang, and the dirt is gone. I mean, at this point, if I had two people down, like, two out of the game, I would probably just quit, in fairness. Like, there's not a whole lot of point. To Maradona. Yep. <laughs> Come on, man. Like, what are we doing? What are we doing? This is just embarrassing at this point. This really is. But... We know how to take free kicks, kind of. Okay, that was pretty shit, but still a chance. Uh, never mind. Packer makes it four. It's just got it's just got a bit ridiculous at this point. The thing is, you ain't, you ain't got enough men, so all my spare players are just marking all the passing opportunities. So, like, wherever you pass it to, it's pretty much going to hit one of my players. It's, it's just the. Uh, Pogba! <laughs> oh, just uh, just dirt at this point. Bang. Pogba! <laughs> oh, second time lucky, and there we go. Why is the ball floating? Anyway, this guy's done, pretty sure. He's out of here. I mean, I'm not sure you've got many subs to make left, but I'm afraid. You've made two of them already on your red card, so it's actually continuing. Crazy. Who did he sub off? He's only got one sub left, so... Well, unless he subbed out whoever was playing the game previously for somebody slightly better, um, then I don't know. Henri gets another goal. Yo, working up to 1,000 goals, you know, we've got to, we've got to feed him. Why is he number 23? i got to change that. Pretty sure he's 14, wasn't he, for Arsenal? Pretty sure he's number 14. Fair play, bud. I, um, why not just quit? Like, what's the issue? What are we doing? You love to see it, don't you? You love to see it. Bang. That's number seven. Bang. <laughs> oh, bang. Eight, one. 8-1. I mean, it, it's, a, it's it's embarrassing because the guy with the silver team yesterday, he scored more goals than this guy did. Admittedly, yeah, this guy got more players sent off, but still. But he's offside. Oh, Henri should have got that. Yo, what a free kick that was. Holy shit. That was a banger. Oh, well, good save by Neuer. What a off-the-line clearance by Boateng. That is truly things you love to see. That is things you love to see. <laughs> he hasn't scored that. Uh, see, like, I tell you, Alisson is just a bit mental. Alisson is mental. He's like the German, uh, the German Neuer. He's the Brazilian Neuer. Henri! <laughs> the Udegaard! Oh my god, he missed that as well. What is up with my players and missing the net? And he's going to get sent off as well. And yeah, game over. Even though it's not going to be game over, even though he's got four red cards, but should be. And Henri is through again. Wow. Come on, man. Well, that's the fifth, anyway. Here's the next red card, surely. Yep. Yep. Now it's game over. Now it's game over. I still, I'm still baffled. This guy lost his head this badly. This badly. He could have. He literally just got a straight red, even though he already had a yellow. Straight red. Well, at least it, it makes it look like the scoreline wasn't quite as bad as it was. So, uh, yeah. 
3-0, essentially, even though I think it was 8-2. Eight, I would 8-2 to be this guy. <laughs> yeah, he scored quite a few nice goals. If he didn't get all those players sent off, um, then I genuinely think he... Um, he could, have, he could have actually been a contender for that game. But, you know, he, I don't think he was that great anyway. Either way, yep, got all those players sent off. Never actually seen this screen before. So the first time I've ever seen the screen because somebody has got everybody sent off. Mental. Mental. And there we go. Henri stat padding again. Four goals. Could have got more, but again, I wasn't really trying too much. It's not a whole lot of point. Um, one goal for Maradona and Maradona. And two for Kaká. Couldn't score with Udegaard, though. Could not score with Udegaard. It's just it's what it is, isn't it? One assist for Pogba. Two for Kappa. Two for Kaká. One for Maradona. And one for Henri. Again, things you love to see. Henri was clinical as well in that game. Clinical. We got nine out of ten. Nine out of ten. But yeah, and there we go. So this team is insane. Really insane. Obviously, that Henri is just next level good. Um, like I say, I've said many times before, I played with Team of the Ronaldo, Team of the Lewandowski, both in foot draft. I think Team of the Team of the Ronaldo, I didn't really enjoy too much, but Team of the Lewandowski, I think, is the only player that I think I would probably enjoy just as much over Henri. But I, I mean, actually, out of curiosity, I'm gonna have a quick look. How much is and was uh, Lewandowski? Just to see. If there was any any way a chance we could actually infor, afford this guy. Um, so what are we saying? Team of the year. So actually, yeah, we, we probably could have. We probably could have uh, afforded Lewandowski. But I I, I wanted Henri more. And I just prefer him, uh, prefer him over uh, over anybody else. So yeah, I'm, uh, I, I'm happy with how this team's turned out. I, I still can't believe our luck to get Yuri Berdachish. The only player that really would have worked. Um, in our team, besides Kante. Crazy. Crazy, crazy stuff. And I think to end off, we're going to have a look at Henri's stats. He's got 10 games played, 23 goals, 2 assists, all in rivals. I like... Pff, mad. Mad. He scores about 2 goals a game. It's just crazy. Crazy good how, how mentally broken this card is. But there we go. There is our team. Obviously, I will be doing an episode of the Road to 1000. And like I say, I want to try and build some interesting teams. We've got that Olivier Giroud. Got some icons now, so we can put in pretty much anybody we, we, we want, really, to be honest. We can kind of build some, uh, hopefully, fairly unique teams. And it should be, should be good fun. Um, but either way... There we go. So there is the end of today's episode. Hopefully you've enjoyed. I do want to say a massive thank you to everyone who has been supporting the series over the course of uh, however long it's been running since, you know, October, November time. Um, you know, the channel's grown quite a lot, obviously, since I started, obviously. But uh, yeah, a massive thank you to everyone who's been subscribing, liking, commenting, you know, saying nice things or even saying negative things. It, it all helps the channel in some degree. Um, so yeah. Big ups to that. Big ups to everyone. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. But either way, that concludes today's episode. Hopefully you have enjoyed. There were some mad goals in this game. There were some mad games, really, to be honest, considering, uh, you know, some of the past episodes. But yeah, I don't know. Some of the opponents we're coming up against to, uh, recently are just really weird. We came up against a silver team. Now we came up against somebody who just lost their head completely and got everybody sent off. Like, uh, what is happening? Really, really don't know, but I'm loving FIFA at the moment. I'm loving playing with this team, playing with players that I enjoy. So hopefully you're enjoying watching it as well. It's really, really is good fun. Good fun. I mean, it's it's not something you say very often when playing FIFA, but it is it is good fun. So hopefully you've enjoyed. If you have, please do drop it like. That'd be very, very much appreciated as always. And if you haven't already, please do consider hitting that subscribe button and become part of the exclusive family. But with that said, I do hope you enjoyed. Thank you very much for watching and as always, we'll see you next time.